Hey fam, how are you all doing? Thank you so much for stopping by. So in today's video, we're going to be talking about the different UK visa routes. Okay, so in this video, I'm just going to be mentioning them and in my later videos, I'm going to go into details talking about the different visas, the requirements and all of that. Okay, but in this video, we're just going to be talking about the different routes, okay? Number one on my list is the visiting visa, the visitor visa that are given to people if you want to come to the UK for a visit for a short time, maybe six months i think the maximum you can get is six months like i said i'll go into details um in other videos so visit a visitor's visa if you want to come to the uk as a tourist if you want to come and visit a family member you can get the the uk visiting visa okay the second visa category on our list would be the work visa okay so this is a visa you get if you want to come to the uk for a paid or an un unpaid um like voluntary work okay so that kind of visa you can apply so once you've gotten a job in the uk you can apply for that visa and then you would get it sometimes it might need sponsorship but that's another kind of visa another category of visa that you can get okay so the third on my list is the student visa okay so if you want to come to the uk to study a course without a degree or maybe just a short course you can get a student visa is that as an adult or as a young adult or as a child you can get a student visa so the next which is the fourth category of visa on my list is a transit visa so if you're going to another country and you're going to be passing through the UK you're going to be spending some time in the UK then you need a transit visa okay like I said I'll go into details in due course okay the next category of visa for me today is the family visa this includes the spouse visa the, the partner visa the dependent visa or a family visa if like I said if you have a family in the UK that you want to come and stay with okay and the last category of visa I'm going to be talking about today is the settlement visa okay so this is for you if you want to settle in the UK there are some criteria that you need to meet there are some requirements and I mean for all the visa categories there are, cat there are criteria and requirements that you need to meet in order to get these visas okay so I thought I'll bring this one to you quickly and in subsequent videos i'll go into details um about the the different visas okay if you have any questions please leave them in the comment section any video category you want me to talk about please leave them in the comment section and i'll be more than happy to look into it but thank you so much for watching this video subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so and i'll see you in my next video